Hello everyone, welcome back to another video training session. Today we are going to be learning how to draw from a cigar properly. Now this is personal preference, this is the ways that I choose, the ways that work for me, and the methods that work for me, so I'm going to share them with you. Hopefully they can help you out too. Alright, now, how to draw when lighting a cigar is different than how to draw when it's already lit, and it's also different than how to draw when you're relighting a cigar if you want to check that video out. Lighting a cigar is kind of the same principles as relighting a cigar. When you're drawing in on the flame to light, you're drawing in just enough. You're pulling in just enough to get that flame in there to light. You're not drawing in as hard as you can. You're not doing anything violent. There's no such thing as an aggressive pull when smoking a cigar. You don't want to be aggressive. You don't want that to happen. You just want it to be nice and soft, and that's it. All right. Now, I had some, one person ask me, how long between draws do I take? And that really depends on cigar to cigar. It depends from cigar to cigar. In other words, with the guidelines that I use to do that is I watch the smoke off of the foot to determine when I need to draw again. When the smoke starts to die down or I don't see it anymore, I definitely know it's time for another draw. Uh, sometimes some cigars like Drew Estate sticks, they will smoke and smoke and smoke until the you know you wake up the next day. And usually for them, you can get away with taking a a draw between a minute and a half, two minutes. This here, I am estimating I can get a draw off it every minute or so. It's burning very nicely. It's not having to think about it. So far, so good with this. Uh, so basically, when you're drawing in. You're just going to take an easy, you're just going to take a nice, easy, slow pull, and that's going to be it. So, that's all you need to do, really. That's it, just a real nice, easy pull. It's, you're not taking a hot pull like you would off a cigarette. You're taking a nice, easy, relaxing, mellow pull to get that full body and smoke in your mouth. Now if the cigar starts to go out a little bit, but it hasn't completely gone out to the point of needing a relight, what you will do, you will take a couple short stiff pulls, a couple short pulls, that way you get the cherry back going again, and then you can take your slow draws again to get the smoke in your mouth. Now it depends on how close it is to being out, because it might require more of those short hot pulls to get the cherry hot enough to where it'll stay lit on its own again. Every cigar is different. There's not really one formula fits all for cigars. Uh, but anyway, those are the basic guidelines. If it's dark outside, like if it's dark and you can't and you can see the actual orange burn line on the cigar, use that as your guideline. So uh, depending on the cigar, when the orange burn on the outside is completely gone out for about 15-20 seconds, take another draw until you see it light up again all the way around. If it doesn't light up again all the way around, that's no big deal, just as long as most of it lights up orange as you take the draw, that's all that matters, and just repeat that process. Some cigars are really are really picky and they require you to draw every, you know, 15-20 seconds. It just depends on the cigar. And those cigars that require you to do that are still a nice slow pull. So anyway, if you guys have any questions, please leave a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe, give a thumbs up, and until next time, we'll see you soon.